My name is Bob Laminska, and um, I'm the owner of Hoyland Farm, which is a vegetable farm. We've been interested in sustainability for a long, long time. Uh, you know, I took place, took part in the first Earth Day in 1970, organizing a canoe trip from Perry down to Lawrence. And uh, so, uh, you know, it's, it's a long-term goal of ours to be as sustainable as possible. We've done that partly by growing food in a sustainable manner, not using any chemicals at all. We've been certified organic for a good portion of the time we've had the farm. As we've gotten larger, we have used more electricity. We got a walk-in cooler several years ago. We use electricity to run pumps to irrigate the, you know, the, the vegetables when they get dry. Grow lights in our cellar to start plants so we can transplant them out as soon as possible. And we were really interested in being sustainable in that we were using electricity that didn't uh, you know, burn coal to create. So <clears throat> we went to a meeting several months ago and met Aaron Cromwell and he gave us some really solid information about some of the options that were available because we've been thinking for years about putting in a solar hot water heater, toyed with the idea of wind turbines. He talked to us about how with new efficiencies that the photovoltaic was probably the way to go and then we could use that electricity to heat the water instead of just heating the water and saving electricity that way. Um, they were very um, responsive. They got, you know, they got back to us quickly when we had any questions and they got out here quickly and got the work done efficiently and the guys who did the work were pleasant to be around and I enjoyed them.